Well, we spent all our money on the buffet because we're stupid, but <laughs> we officially established the Phantom Thieves, so it was totally worth it. Uh, no. We came out of that with only six grand. Well, six thousand yen, which is like 60 bucks. The Phantom Thieves, huh? I'm liking the sound of that. Uh, excuse me, we're your chaps. I hope we can really help people. I'm curious about that Phantom Aficionado website, too. I wonder who made it. I don't know. No clue. More importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there was this approval rating thing, but it was only at like 6%. Um, honestly, that's more than I'd expect. I guess it's not so bad if you put it like if you put it that way. But don't you just want to get it higher than that? I bet it'll go up tons if we keep taking down big targets. It's pretty damn exciting if you try and think about it like that. Honestly, I wouldn't care. You know, you're actually right. Well then, let's keep working hard from this point on. The Thieves' Den. What is this? The Thieves' Den has been unlocked. You can access the Thieves' Den from the menu or from the title screen. At the Thieves' Den, various activities such as view art, listen to music, or play card games. The more with story progression, so stop by now and then. Okay. So it's a little extra mode. Interesting. Oh yeah, let me send this. Uh, let me send the, cele the celebratory pick I took for today. Celebrating the founding of the Phantom Thieves. I, uh, he means your chaps and celebrating us crashing that classy buffet. Oh, I'm a little disappointed that they're not like actually knocking something over. You can cool it with all the celebrating anytime now. Wait, you took that while I was eating? Why didn't you tell me? Uh, I did, you just never stopped. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Anyways, this is our start as the Phantom Thieves. We're, we're your chaps. We're gonna take the world by storm. All the shitty adults in the world better watch out. Ugh. It's really? It, eh. <laughs> Maybe it's just because I'm, nice. I'm freaking 30. But. <laughs> well, at the time I'm uploading this, I'm 30. And, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> anyway. Thieves Den updated. Whoop de doo. Well. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. I don't know anything about it. <laughs> We'll look at the Thieves' Den thing later, because I'm guessing that's an extra mode. I feel like I'm getting closer to improving my knowledge. Knowledge is power. And uh, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to improve our knowledge. Now listen yeah. up. What do you want to yes, do? Yes, we're going to study. Make sure you close up. Can I talk? No, stay quiet. <laughs> <laughs> You're making some good progress. Yeah, we've seen that. <laughs> you think the cat would go and watch TV or something? I mean, well then. But whatever. First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate! You have encountered allies who share your ideals, and you have found your place in reality. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. I shall explain it to you now. You have a special potential. However, that must be refined into a useful power. It is weak now, but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin. That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. The fusion process I taught you prior 
is another. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. If you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractor's inmate. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. Thanks to the contracts you formed, your heart is steadily gaining the power of opposition. It seems the rehabilitation is going well. This is a truly joyous occasion. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes for you. Alright, now we can hold even more personas. Up to eight, in fact. Alright. Which is pretty spiffy. I wouldn't think they'd need to explain that in a tutorial, but okay. The time has come. Return to your brief moments of rest. You know, you guys could let me get a full night of sleep once in a while. And don't forget to go talk to your contractor's inmate. <laughs> okay, we've been doing this quite a bit already, but yeah, it's going to tell us about confidants. Although I'm pretty sure they've already told us about them. <laughs> I'm almost positive they've already explained confidants to us. Hey, my birthday. I wish I had money. I'd kill for a real breakfast. Broke-ass college dude. I just saw that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Broke. Oh, uh, that's hilarious. A huge wow. burger, huh? Interesting. <laughs> I, I guess. I bet giving that a go will increase your guts. That's actually what I was wanting to do earlier, but, uh... Apparently I was mistaken. Apparently it's only at nighttime. Like you heard last week, gym class is cancelled today. Instead, I'm supposed to give you some guidance. The gist is, don't go around talking about the incident. That's all. The police are still investigating Mr. Kamoshida, so I can't say anything myself. As a teacher, though, I'm ashamed for not having noticed that a student was suffering like that. I'm not defending him, but as a colleague, he just seemed like, well, a normal person. Really? He came off as a pretentious dick to me, but whatever. Honestly, it still doesn't feel real. I guess people can have multiple sides to them. Hence, personas. I, I, it all has to do with the psycho psychology effect. The teachers have it rough, huh? Or rather, angle, not effect. Oh, yeah. I just remembered something I learned about psychology. Hey, go figure. They say that humans have several different personalities hidden in their subconscious. Different personalities? Oh, to be clear, I'm not talking about multiple personality disorder. These different personalities can be a different gender or a different age from you. I mean, if you think about how gods and monsters and myths were first based on the human image. If you actually saw one of those personalities with your own eyes, it might look like a monster. Mm hmm. Hmm? You all seem more alert than usual. Did I finally talk about something that interests you? Well, I'm just saying what I've heard. It feels like I just now understood what I learned long ago. <laughs> okay, these teachers do not seem to have lesson plans. Just saying, that's very much not the way teaching is, but... Mm. It 
ain't much, but we've been getting more postings on the Phantom Aficionado website. I want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff I lent him. <sighs> Deal with that yourself! <laughs> yeah, go tell him to give you your shit back. <laughs> hey, those girls. You know that Phantom Thieves rumor about stealing Kamashita's heart? I wonder if it's true. It's gotta be made up. Do you seriously believe they exist? But look what happened to Kamashita. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. I wonder if it'll affect our college entrance. That's probably a normal reaction for now, but they'll see soon enough. If we can take care of two or three famous guys, people will have to believe we exist. So about those big shots, we don't have any leads yet, right? Plus, there's that rumor about you two threatening Kamoshida, too. Looks like you'll just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. Still, make sure you stay prepared just in case anything comes up, all right? I'll keep an eye out for info on any big shots that might be coming around. And I'll try to dig up some dirt online. Because you can always trust what you find online. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group, but we can't even find a target. There, there. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Excuse me. Did you wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? You saw the state Kamashita-kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. From what I've heard, it appears as though some students were meddling in his business. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamashita to change? That is what I wish to know, even if it takes some probing into student matters. I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamashita, but do you mean... All of this talk about those phantom thieves? It is undeniable that Mr. Kamoshida has changed in some way. I'd like to have a grasp of the cause. This shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. Oh. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will likely never die down. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation for any college of your choosing, Makoto Nijima. Th thank you. Your lineage must certainly play a part in this excellence. Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? If something disappointing were to happen here, that wouldn't reflect very well on your sister. Do you understand? Not really. I'm not seeing how the two have to do with one another. Yes. <laughs> how wise. It's no wonder you're our student council president. I'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible. I ask that you begin at once. Yes, if you'll excuse me then. It's me, sir. My apologies for troubling you at such a busy time. Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. I have all bases covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Mm hmm, of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for your time.
police are really here. I saw them at the entrance. I saw them too. They're talking to the teachers. That change of heart thing seriously amazing, huh? I hope they don't find out we're responsible. I'm pretty sure we'll be fine. There's no proof it was us. Um... <laughs> should we turn ourselves in? Hell no. <laughs> but I, I mean, haven't rumors been going around about how you guys threatened Kamashita? This world's Kamashita shouldn't know anything about what actually happened to him, though. Eh, still, we did what was right. Don't go freaking out over some label. I guess that's true. Man, I really can't wait to keep living this double life. Okay, buddy. All right, Bean, we're going to be counting on you. Hey, are you listening? I feel a murderous intent. Oh! <laughs> that looked like it hurt. He hit him in the forehead. Pay attention. It's what you get for daydreaming. Kids these days. No respect, I say. No respect. Good grief. Looks like you need more proficiency. <laughs> Yeah. Proficiency is probably the social stat I've been neglecting the most. But there's a reason for that, and that's because we're going to have plenty of chances. Hey. Hi. How's it going? Have you seen that Phantom Aficionado website? The uh, what site? I'm the one who started it. Um... You guys are the Phantom Thieves, aren't you? Um, you know, I, I could use some space. Sorry. Although, if things really are as I think, I should keep it a secret. Kamoshida used me, and I did some horrible things to you guys. This isn't much of a way for me to apologize for it. But if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. Uh, okay. I'm glad to hear that. It's not just Kamoshida. There are tons of evil adults out there. But I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. They can't let this end after just one target. That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll on the site. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves or not? I want to work on this forum so eventually it'll be packed with tons of supportive posts. I'd really like to help out in the Phantom Thieves acts of justice. Can I? For justice? Uh, I don't really care. It's up to you. <laughs> in that case, I'll just do what I want. Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. What do you have to say to that? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the moon persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Yeah, and with that we've gotten Mishima as a con as a confidant. Uh, his is actually one of the most well. I don't know about most useful, but his is really good, so we're going to actually pay some attention to his. Also, his card is a little disturbing. All right. See you.
We heard all that. Jeez. It was a little awkward trying to figure out when to walk over here. So that forum is Mishima-kun's. Has he figured out our identities? Even so, I think it'll be fine. He seemed to be playing it cool. <laughs> if you call making a website to uh, be a huge fan playing it cool, but whatever. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. I will say, though, a forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we should prep our equipment and... Wait! Oh, crap! <laughs> What's with you? Don't we have an exam coming up? Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. I'd rather that than be bad at every subject. Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. So, eh, if I haven't mentioned this, this takes place in Japan. There's, even though they're all speaking English while we're playing this, it's supposed to be Japanese that they're speaking. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. <laughs> Good comeback, huh? Let's discuss this with our fists. You don't have fists. Bring it. Will you two stop it? Okay. Let's not draw any attention to ourselves until we find our next target. Don't forget to study, though. I'm not getting blamed if your grades start dropping. <laughs> what to do between targets? Uh, you can do things around the city until you find your next target. Blah, blah, blah. The stuff we've been doing, basically. Uh, I actually kind of do have plans today because, as you can clearly see, on... On it happens to be ready for confidant build. Hi there. Oh man. I don't know. I like it. I think it's goofy. <laughs> and I have a soft spot for goofy things. Anyway, On's ready to build her confidant uh, relationship with us, so we're gonna end up starting that today, probably. Uh, first though, I want to go to Central Street. And buy some books, maybe. Welcome. The Medjed Menace. Okay, well, it raises our knowledge, so I want it. Uh, the diner looks like it's open, but we're not going to do that yet. What I am going to do is save and take a little break, and so I'll see you guys here in a little bit. Alrighty, so we're back, and uh, like I said... Before I took my little break, we're going to go and we're going to spend a bit of time with On. Uh, because, well, why not? We finally have a chance to build up that confidant, our confidant, our social status with her. Uh, hi, ladies. Okay, then. Anyway felt like someone was watching me this morning. What should I do? Maybe it wouldn't hurt to at least ask. No, but then... Lady On seems depressed. Uh, never mind, it's nothing. I should be able to invite her out with my current kindness. So if your kindness wasn't up to rank 2 by this point, you wouldn't be able to build your... Uh, your confidant rank with On at this point, and so that's why I wanted to make sure it was at 2 before now. I'm fine, seriously. Besides, I wouldn't want to trouble you. Eh, tell me about your problems. Are you sure? You're so reliable. Okay. I guess it wouldn't be so bad talking about you, talking with you about this stuff. And because I have a lover's persona, it'll work even better. So, so what do you think? Will you spend some time with Lady On? Uh, yes. Thanks! Alright, let's go to the diner. Well, I'm gonna walk around. Let me know when you're ready to leave. Um, 
Hey, um, there's something I want to talk to you about, Bean. It's Chiho. Well, I went to visit her in the hospital. She, she said she was sorry. Sorry for not telling me about Kamashita, about all the things he was doing to her. But it was my fault too. I didn't realize how much trouble she was in. I wasn't there for her. So I apologized as well. Um. Uh, she's so strong. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Isn't she? Shiho really is a great girl. I'm glad I finally got to tell her everything I couldn't bring myself to say before. Hey. And, um, remember how Kamashita threatened to take Shio off the team if I didn't sleep with him? <laughs> I had only agreed to it so that I wouldn't ruin Shiho's dreams, but now that I think about it, he never would have put her on the bench and cost his team games. I seriously should have dared him to try and take her starting spot, but in the end, maybe I just didn't believe in her ability. Uh, okay, hold on. He had the upper hand, I guess. But... Oh, that might have been true. But honestly, I think it was all because of how weak I am. That's why I believe Kamashita's authority outweighed Shiho's own ability to earn her starting spot. Um... Bean, do you remember the last time I talked to you like this? When I got that phone call from Kamashita and cried, I felt so alone. Scared even. <laughs> but because you were uh, but because you were there for me, I decided not to go. I was a little surprised at how pushy you were about it, as in you were stalking her. But I see now Thanks. you just wanted to help. Thanks. Uh I uh, couldn't just ignore you. <laughs> You're so kind. <laughs> Back then, people used to call me all sorts of names. <sighs> Prissy bitch, Kamashita's girl. I got tired of it pretty quickly. But to tell you the truth, someday I want to be able to take labels like that in stride. Hey! Hey, um, personas are the power of the heart, right? That means if my heart gets stronger, my persona will too, right? Right? So I want to strengthen my heart. And I want to use that strength to help the people around me. I hope we can save people from trouble just like we did when we changed Kamashita's heart. Hmm. Though, honestly, I don't even know what strong is. But I'm going to find the answer, I promise. Uh, let's find it together. Huh? Really? Thanks! Thanks, I feel like I'm a little stronger already. I guess that doesn't really count though, does it? <laughs> Well, I'll be relying on you. Let's train together and make our hearts super strong. D okay. Girl talk, if negotiation with a female shadow fails, you can try again. Like the punk talk? I want to say that's a new thing, but that's eh, not going to be that big of a deal because we're not going to be doing a whole lot of negotiating. All right. A strong heart. Hmm. Oh yeah. How about this? I won't get any refills on fountain drinks. What? I mean, they're free, so not getting any would mean you have a strong heart. What? Hmm? Is that not right? Uh, no. Bye. <laughs> no, that's just stupid. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's just that's just dumb. Oh, hey, it's me. Thanks for listening to what I had to say earlier. Now I feel like I have a better idea of who I want to be, I guess. Also, I'm going to think of how I can strengthen my heart. If I think of anything, I'll let you know. I hope you'll join me again next time. Uh... <laughs> the no refills thing again. Uh, let's go with leave it to me. Yeah, I had a feeling that the no refills thing was. <laughs> Good lord. That's the key to this place. Oh, thanks! You get to lock up from now on. I can't keep waiting for you to come home. Don't start any fires, okay? 
All right, I'll try. We can now leave Yongin Jaya at night. Hey! You want to go out now that you hear loud? Oh, come to think of it, shouldn't we stop by that airsoft shop and ask about that paper bag? Hey. Uh, we also got the sooty armor and there's a laundromat. Uh, there's a lot of stuff we can do. First things first, I want to check on the plant. Nice. Okay, the plant is fine. But yeah, with nighttime, or rather with us being able to pretty much leave the area at nighttime, a lot of things have opened up. Uh, although there's nothing we can do at the, at the school, uh, mostly in Shibuya for right now, there's a lot of stuff available to us. So there's two confidants we could get right now. One's at the airsoft shop, if you couldn't guess. That would be a why. The other one is one that I'm not even going to waste my time with. Uh, because I think his confidant is one of the worst, like absolutely one of the worst ones. Or at least it was. If it's changed, then I don't know about it. Anyway, though, I don't actually think we're going to be going out. I think we're going to actually study. But let's check our social stats first. Hey. Yeah, we're going to study. Because I'm hoping we can manage to get to a rank 3 knowledge before now exam listen time. Up. What do you want to do? Make sure you close up. Wow! Move a little to the right, I can't see the screen. Uh, volleyball beating investigation. The school claims to have left to have left teaching methods up to its staff. What? It has denied once again that it had any knowledge of the beatings. Call and warning, as of next week, greater volume and arriving later than in previous years. Hot spots of Tokyo experiencing art in Shibuya. The Madarame exhibit opens next week. Hmm. People are really talking about the Kamashita incident. No one in this car knows that we're the ones who did it. I don't think anyone in that car really cares. Yep, yep. Oh yeah, we got exams starting on Wednesday. Don't tell me you forgot. Open your textbooks. Anyway, today we'll be talking about the tale of the bamboo cutter. Most theorize it's the oldest story in Japan. For some, it's the oldest science fiction story in the world. But if you ask me, it's the oldest story, the oldest story in Japan about a terrible woman. I mean, Princess Kaguya gives her suitors absurd tasks, demands fancy gifts, and then runs off to the moon. The bitch. <laughs> Some men lose their fortunes, some are humiliated, and some even get serious wounds or go blind. Women like Princess Kaguya actually show up a, in a lot of stories from around the world. Now then. <laughs> Good lord. Do you know the answer? Probably heard that a woman who uses her wiles <laughs> to lead people to their doom is a femme fatale. So what's the literal translation of the phrase femme fatale? Uh, okay, I'm... Um, yeah. Wow, who in the world would guess Honey Trap or Woman of... Okay, Woman of Fate, I could baby see, but why would someone guess Honey Trap? Okay, the obvious answer is it's a fatal woman. This is it. Exactly. The answer is fatal woman in French, of course. Uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Not to mention the wild seductive dancer of opera, Carmen. Also known as Anne's Persona. Honey trap. Why would someone? They were probably just mashing the button because it does start there. 
Let me just warn you that exams aren't so easy that you can pass them with a single night of cramming. Take your time and make sure you understand the material, okay? <laughs> uh, you heard her. Must be rough being a student. Yeah, sucks to be us, right? <laughs> well, you have nothing to lose from studying. Give it all you got. None of these posts are any good. Everyone's just bitching about their parents or their boyfriends. Uh, there ain't even a hint of a hint about a new palace. We can't get everything online. Finding a post with a name and location is asking a lot. Guess we just gotta find one ourselves then. Are you seriously suggesting we look for a target that even the police have overlooked? Yeah, you're right. We should probably just hold off till exams are done with, huh? We can wait and see for a little longer, then worry about coming up empty-handed if it happens. Oh. This place is off-limits, you know. <sighs> we'll get out of here once we're done chatting. Anyways, what's Miss Council President want with us? The troublemaker, the center of gossip, and the infamous transfer student. Hmm, interesting combination. <sighs> Great way to start a conversation. By the way, it seems as though you got to know Mr. Kamoshida pretty well. Anyone who attends this school would have interacted with him, whether they liked it or not. Hmm. I heard Mr. Kamoshida used a volleyball team member to spread details of your past record. Don't you hate him? Mr. Kamoshida, I mean. What's all this about? My friend here's an upstanding guy. I don't mean to offend. Many students have been shaken up by what happened with Mr. Kamoshida. The rumors about that odd calling card-esque posting aren't going away either. I didn't expect someone like you would care about that tactless stuff, Mijima-senpai. I don't know that it was tactless. Anyways, we done here? We can't leave if you keep talking to us. At least try to understand my position. Being forced to deal with this horseplay. Horseplay? Ah, oh, yes, by the way. It's been decided that this place will be closed off due to the incident. It only took them like four weeks. I heard some people are coming up here without permission, after all. I'm sorry to have interrupted you. What was that about? She's on to us. That girl seems rather sharp. We should be cautious of her. She really pisses me off. Everything pisses you off. Uh, she's figured us out. Yeah, talk about a pain in the ass. That reminds me. <laughs> Study hard. Especially you, Ryuji. There are bound to be traps that will need to be solved with brains. Keep in mind that everything you do in your daily lives has an impact on your abilities. True. Studying won't be so bad if we just think of it as helping us prepare to be phantom thieves. Um... I guess you got a point. But man, it's just so lame. I was all fired up about helping people, not about studying. Well, I do have somewhere interesting to show you beforehand. You guys did originally promise to help me out with my mission, after all. Huh? Mission? Follow me. 